Hey, welcome everybody. Hello, the Binding of Isaac repents another episode. Here we go. Thank you guys so much for all the likes on the last episode, all the interaction. You keep up that train, I'll keep up this train. I'm gonna reach down. The comment of the day. Let's see what we got. Man's been playing Isaac for thousands of hours. Doesn't even know how Book of Rev greatly increases the chance of horsemen as bosses. SMH. Yeah, I'm an idiot. <laughs> At, like right after I posted that, uh, my friend Nick, longtime mod and first sub ever over on the Twitch, messaged me and he was like, "Hey, you're gonna get some comments. Um, you completely overlooked the fact that uh, you had Book of Rev and it increases Horseman." And I'm like, "Yes, I'm an idiot." So, whoops. Um, but still, fun run last time. All right, what are we going to do now? Um, so you might see the win streak number is, is at three. Twitch.tv slash wolves in my door. I play so much Isaac. And if you don't like Twitch or don't want to go over to Twitch, I post every Twitch VOD over on my second YouTube channel, which you could find in the description. WLVS Archive. It's just a place where I archive everything. I also thumbnail and label everything for your viewing pleasure so if you want to watch my first reaction to the final ending that's over there the 12 hour launch stream that's over there a lot of these unlocks are over there as well i mean they're long vods so you could skip through and stuff but also as if i haven't pimped my own self out enough wlvs.shop the hotel keys and pins are sold out but the hats are available the day tripper bag the all the hoodies are available windbreaker available shorts available uh, cooking apron and all the t-shirts all available until April 19th April 19th all right now that all the business is out of the way let's see what are we gonna do um we could do Beth we could try Bethany mother that could be interesting we definitely got some some mother things to do uh, we could try to unlock one of these characters we have Jacob and Apollyon that we still need to do. Um, that seems tough. Well, Jacob does at least. Apollyon we could do. Yeah, let's try to get let's try to get Alt Apollyon. What? Locked? Wait, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I was like, the post-it note on this guy is full. Why would I want to do this guy? I'm an idiot. What is what is going on with my brain, man? This is a very interesting start. Explosivo. I'll take it. It seems uh, good enough to take and not, not to suck. Because Explosivo can be very powerful. And also not super dangerous as long as you keep your distance. Fast forward 10 minutes into the video where I am blowing myself up with Explosivo. Yeah, I don't know. I, I lapse in judgment there. I thought, I thought, oh, the post-it is filled, so we got to play as the alt character. But in reality, we got to play as the normal character to unlock the alt character. Look at that explosivo, working as a bomb right there. Wow. Okay, that's a decent amount of money. We also got a black heart already, which pretty rare, honestly, nowadays. We are gonna have a free shop here. We're already up to 14 cents because of that dime. Is this for real? There we go. 15 cents. Wow. It's not great. I'll tell you that much. It is not great. We will do this just to try to get a nickel. Get some money to go down to the next floor with. This is an XL, so there will be another another uh, item room. Let's shoot the poops. Do our poo-poo diligence. 21 cents. Here is our other item shop. Item shop, item room. God, brain, just please. It's like, come on. It, it, the episode just started. Like, if my brain was like this, you know, 50 minutes into the episode, that's fine. But, like, come on. I will take the miter. It's a good item ha to have. I, uh, I feel like we haven't sucked anything yet. Usually, uh, usually I'm suck crazy. But honestly, some decent items. We are going to get two boss fights here. We're also going to get a deal with the devil. 
which uh, we got to be very considerate of this black heart. And make sure we hold on to it. Wow. <laughs> I don't know the chances of shooting a poop and finding a soul heart, but that is nice. All right. This is where you want to get Explosivo stuck on one of them and then don't kill them and let them blow up a lot of their friends. But that has not unfortunately happened yet. I feel like I'm missing with all my Explosivo tiers. Literally all of them. There's one, but melted. Little too late. All right, here is our boss rooms. And since it's, oh, that's a dumb, dumb idea. Uh, that's okay. We'll get this coin. Since it's the first floor, it is an XL, but it is very small. Love that we got an Explosivo tier on him. Got another one on him. That should end the fight. And that's another take. I like speed and range. And it's also a syringe. We could have uh, sucked it and got different stat up. Two different stat ups. But it, it wouldn't have counted as a syringe. And also... You never guaranteed what your... Uh, and that's a tears up. So we're going to take that one as well. Okay. I do love Gimpy, so I think I'm going to take Gimpy here. The theme is whatever, but I like Gimpy. And, um, let's just skedaddle, man. I mean, we got 20, we, we, uh, that was a very good first floor. Granted, it was technically two floors. It was just really good. We got to remember the biggest thing about this run is to get a trinket and drop it in an item room or a boss room. That is one of the biggest things about this run because we need to get the cracked red key to unlock, which is our main goal. I would like to beat the beast, even though we've already done it on the post-it. I would like to beat the beast, but our main goal is to unlock Tainted Apollyon. Look at Gimpy. Look at Gimpy, man. So inspirational. Love to see that. Got a bad trip pill, but Gimpy paid us back instantly. Unfortunately, we took some damage here. Not proud of it. Speaking of trinket, there you go. Just can't seem to hit these guys. There we go. Got to get him lined up like that. Oh, he has a tear on him. Bit overkill on the fly. This seems worth it. And I think that should trigger the other bomb rock. Oh, it did not. Okay. Well, well, that's definitely worth it. Love a tears up. Hmm. Bomb for a key. Nah. We will do this, though, in case there's a magic mush or mini mush under there. There is not. Um, secret room could be there. Could be there. Let's try it. It is. Nice. More bombs and more keys needed. We could try to get a nickel there to get to 30 cents and make the shop even more viable, but we got to be careful. I don't want to use too many keys. Don't like being left with no bombs. Wow. We've gotten two dimes in the first two floors. That's very good. Very, very good. Uh, we will drop one of these trinkets in the item room. just Or either the item room or the boss room. The boss room is a lot easier because then you don't... You pretty much can't miss it. Okay. All of a sudden, our health's not looking so good. Just leave him to explode. Just leave him to explode as well. It's going to be Bumbo here. And I don't necessarily dislike Bumbo, but I don't know if I really want Bumbo right now. I think we're going to suck it in. 
Um, we got some tears and some lock. I don't want to use my key there, even though I feel like I might get a key in return. I want to make sure we have a key for the shop. Speaking of the shop, here it is. Jar of flies. I mean, I could attach... What is with that? I, that must be the mitre or something. Um, we could attach it to our void. It just... that, that That's not... That, that doesn't really excite me, unfortunately. Hmm. I will buy the charge. We did get a couple keys, so I will go back and open this golden chest. Some more money. We're back up to 43 cents. We're just really hoping for good shops at this point because money is everywhere. Wasn't sure if I hit him with an explosivo tier, but I think it was behind him. So that's another tiers up. So our tiers are pretty dang good, and that was a shot speed up as well. Definitely not something I would uh, consume with the void. Thinking about a super secret room, and I'm thinking it's probably here. It could be elsewhere, but... That's good, because health was struggling a little bit. I think everything has been gotten we could go get that rune but i know there were spikes and stuff let's just go let's just go there was that secret room that had like you know blow up this unlock this and get a gray chest that doesn't always seem like it's a good idea i did forget to drop the trinket in the boss room but that's okay we have plenty of time to to remember oh come over here come over here yeah 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 Okay, well, we get Mr. Boom. I don't think we want to attach this to our void. It's not necessarily a bad thing to have attached to your void, but it's also a thing where maybe you forget and then you're just sitting on a gigantic bomb and you don't realize. Uh, and also, if you really need a bomb, then you're tempted to use it and then you want to, you know, void an item and you don't have the charge. That's kind of where it gets a little dicey. I mean, Explosivo can be very good. As you just saw. I mean, once they get the Explosivo tier on them, you could just leave them to blow up. bit dicey. Mm. Says there's a soul heart back there. I don't know if Gimpy dropped it or what happened. Got a nice little bridge made for us. That's, that's very nice. Maybe, oh, maybe there's just a natural drop on the room. Because I don't think I got hit in this room. I got hit in this room. Gonna be pins. Yikes. I mean that was that was a very well coordinated attack from all three of those pins. I'm not mad about it. They deserve to get the hit on me. That's just very unlucky. Very unlucky there. Okay, we found our boss room. A lot of gray chests. A lot of chests in general. Okay, we should get a deal with the devil here. Let's just go in. Oh, wow. We got the bomb rock to help us out as well. That's a, that's a lot of teratomas here. It's a lot of explosions. I mean, definitely a boss where uh, <laughs> Explosivo is very dangerous. <laughs> um, Probably void that. Okay, more soul hearts. More soul hearts. Okay. And, uh, yeah, I think we void this. And then I will drop this trinket here. I would like to have a trinket. Usually I like dropping the trinket when I have two. Oh, we do have two. 
Yeah, we'll take Mom's Pearl. Uh, we'll leave Brittle Brittle Bone in there. And this is Flooded Caves 2. So the Caves 2, when we're on our way back up, should be the spot in which the Cracked Red Key is. Which we need to use to unlock the closet to get Tainted Apollyon. Okay, I've had two bad pills. And Amnesia is not a good one, especially because we have not found our item room yet and we need to keep searching for it. I'm assuming it's in this direction. But we don't know for sure. There's another trinket. This is in this direction and our all important shop with 45 cents is also here. Another trinket. Okay. Dude, this item is so sick. I got this last night on stream. Quince, they lurk inside. Very cool item here. We're gonna take Steam Sale. We are gonna buy Mom's Purse. We are going to buy a Soul Heart. We are also, we're gonna buy out the whole entire shop. Not only gonna buy out the entire shop, gonna try to get a nickel here. We did, and since we have Burt Penny, we turned that into a bomb as well. I'm pretty sure there's more to this floor, but I am just going to get out of here. There's a free bomb sitting here. We should probably take that. But yeah, there's probably more to this floor, but let's just get out of here. We know where the boss room is. You know, you, you, you travel deeper in and then all of a sudden you're very lost. I think it's this way. Yeah. All right. I think that was pretty good. I, I, to be honest, I, these, I know what Burnt Penny does, but this, if I had to guess, this maybe helps with Soul Heart Drops or Eternal Heart Drops? I don't know. Uh, the Finger Bone, I do not know. You know what? I like bombs and all, but I think we're good on bombs for right now. So let's just, let's leave that one there. And we'll take the, the two ones we don't really know. Sip of the old iced coffee as we go down. Challenge room. We got to check it out. Oh, yuck. I think I hit him with a... Yeah. Got to always be aware. Uh, all right. So we have a teleport card. So if you guys weren't aware of what this item I said was really cool, what it does. When you kill an enemy, I believe it has a chance to spawn a familiar. So see, we just killed that enemy. It spawned a little brim. It spawned it spawned a bunch of enemies, which is awesome. Or not enemies. It spa spawned a bunch of familiars from killing those enemies. As you can see over here, we got a little Steven. Um, yeah, it's 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 very cool. Very cool item. Took some damage there. I'm not proud of it. Well, that was awkward. Had to dodge out of the way because my tear was going to explode. And then I um, dodged right into it. Some more money, which is great because we have Steam Sale. This guy has a thing on him. See all these uh, familiars we spawned? Pretty cool. You get Rotten Baby here. We got uh, Robo Baby. It's nice. Let's hope for our shop and item room up here. I mean, it's it's not really an item where it's like you're going to be conscious of like where your familiars are shooting, but it's kind of nice that they're just on the screen. So they have, you you know, you got extra tears going everywhere. That's going to get me that bomb. Thank you. Uh, we'll take nine volt and um, we'll also take the habit. I'll check out the card. It's an emperor card. Okay, better than a hermit. Mm -mm, see our item room. It is not great. We will use the void. Exploded them and opened up the door. Okay. Come on, mate. 
come on, come on. We got to be better dodging. This feels like it is towards the boss. We definitely have not. Oh, did not expect the pins. Another trinket. He is going to blow up. Let's go fight our boss here. Got to get a cut before they leave, before they jump. Hopefully it explodes. It did not explode somehow before they jumped. Very strange. This is very dangerous to have uh, explodey tears on the rolly boy. But honestly, we have kept them at bay. I don't know if it's the ice familiar or what, but that was pretty nice. Uh, we're only going to get a caffeine pill here. I was going to say, this is going to be a good pill, right? Because we've had so many bad ones. It wasn't. Should I have sucked in caffeine pill? Yes. Yes, I should have. Do I regret it? Yes. This is a dangerous room to look for a secret room on. I don't know. I feel like we should full explore for some reason. I'm not sure why. Sometimes you just get that feeling. Not the easiest room here. Did work our way out of it without getting hit, though. a tinted rock, even a uh, super secret rock to maybe get small rock. Doesn't seem like it. Nothing really doing. We do have to remember on the next floor we need a bomb to blow up the tinted skull. Very important. Pins. Since we came all the way down here, we might as well just go to the curse room. And we did get nine lives and curse of the tower. I think we take nine lives and uh, we suck in curse of the tower, which we get more tears and shot speed back up after taking a shot speed down pill. Uh, we could have emperored out of there, of course, but I'm holding on to it for a rainy day. Which I don't really know what I'm holding on to it for because we actually actively don't want to use it. So I should have used it there. Hindsight being 2020. I should have definitely used it there. Because we need the full card in our hand before we go into the mom fight, which this is the depths too. This is when we fight mom. And then, uh, yeah, we need the full card to get out of there. So we don't want an emperor card in there because we won't be holding the full card because we would have been, you know, holding the emperor. So yeah, it was a pretty dumb decision to take damage on the way out of that curse room, but wow, that's a lot of that's a lot of explosivo tears right away. Unfortunately, it only kills phase one of it. And then the other ones just fall off. Look at our familiars going in. <laughs> Alright, hit it early dead end there. I am keeping an eye out for the uh, skull. Well, to be honest. I'm keeping an eye out now for the skull. I might have seen it in the first two rooms. Just stay here and do our thing. Love it. No tinted skull here. Trinket doesn't really interest me. We could shoot these guys in the face because the explosivo. I oh, no, it doesn't stick. Maybe it does. I don't know. I can't tell. Okay. Alrighty. Um, a curse room? Yeah, but we're, honestly, after... I just... I don't know. We lost a red heart because of nine lives. I just feel like probably shouldn't be sacrificing any HP, especially this late in the run. And it is pretty late in the run considering what our objective is. It's only, you know, once we get to the depths, too, which we're already at, is all we got to do is kill mom and then go to the mausoleum. And then once we get to the mausoleum, too, we don't even have a boss fight. So we're pretty late in the run, all things considered. 
when usually this wouldn't be considered late in the run at all. And I, again, I do want to kill the beast, but also we don't have to. We've already killed the beast with a polyon. I would like to do it for pure entertainment value, but the, the real goal here is to unlock alt apollyon. Okay, we have 26 cents and steam sale. That's going to be coupon, which isn't great. Wheel of fortune. I think we just, we just use some money here to try to get a soul heart. We do have a two luck stat. The Emperor card, a Temperance card. Okay. That blew up pretty quickly. Oh, so I guess that doesn't always blow up into a crystal ball. I feel like it used to, no? Do this. Get a couple spiders pop out, pop back in. And we could attach the coupon to our void, but... Doesn't really seem that interesting. We're going to take Bozo here, party time. There is our Tinted Skull. Alright, just pop that there. Should be good enough. Yes, and we get the secret room. Dude, where are all the good pills? I don't understand. <laughs> What, what's going on here, bud? This would be our second syringe. I feel like we're in a good spot right now, especially with our tier rate. I don't know if it's even worth it. The only thing I'm thinking is suck it in. So we sucked it in. We got range and tears again. We got range, which is good, because I think we just ran into a range down pill. completely roasted bloat there geez um and we get an eternal heart as a payout that's very nice now if we could not lose that that would be even more nice uh let's we have the fool we 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 don't have a suck ready you know what let's go get a suck ready just in case Pretty easy two rooms here, so no harm, no foul. You never know. We could we could get like um you know a satanic bible or something in the deal with the devil. We do have a 72% chance of the deal with the devil, so I was gonna say, let's go. It's gotta be good. And boom. One of the best pills you can get. I forget what color it was though. Problem is, Explosivo doesn't really work on Mom unless, uh, for some reason, she sticks around for a while. None of her parts usually stick around for a while. So no explosions happening here, and you can see our true strength, which is not very impressive. The parts just spawn and despawn way too quick. We do have, like, a kind of a tower defense of familiars going on right now in... in three of the cardinal directions, which is kind of sick. Like, they're kind of taking out the spawns very quickly. So, let's just grab this. We'll check this out. Very unfortunate. There's no guppy items. But, I don't think anything is really worth taking, to be honest. Yeah, I don't think it's worth taking. I think we just uh, we just full card and get out of here, and then we open up this door, and we probably leave. I mean, I could go to the arcade, I guess. Let's go to the arcade, sure. Why not? Might as well. Since the donation machine is here, why not give it some love? I've, I've only abused the donation machine, it seems, in the past. 
pretty sure we get a, a, a shop on Mausoleum 2, which is what we're about to enter, but I'm not that worried. We do have Steam Sale, and if we really want something, we could try, probably full clear the floor and find it. Tough room here. Tough room. Very tough room. Thank you, Gimpy. Gimpy knew it was a tough room. Knew we had to pay out. Another tough room. All right. Could have been better. Could have been handled better. Probably if I hit the teleporter quicker and, and maneuvered a little bit. We did run into a dead end. Curse room is tempting, but I don't know. I don't know if it's worth it. We, uh, we just really need to survive until uh, we unlock this character. Well, that was big brain. I didn't mean to do it, but it was big brain. I put an explosivo tier on this guy, and he ran to his healer, and, uh... Well, now I wish I took experimental treatment, because this would be spun right here, but we still have room for more speed, so let's take it. That's really tough. Do you see what I mean? Like, you got to be at the diagonal here to block the fire, and then you got to be... Okay, so I was explaining it to you, and then it gave him time to reload. <laughs> you got to be at the diagonal here to block the fire, but if you're too far down, this guy's uh, cardinal direction shot will get you. Tough stuff there. But rewarded with a, a single soul heart. That's nice. of the teleporters as soon as possible. The speed upgrade has helped greatly in our defensive ability. Charge key. We're going to get Sackhead here. We'll just buy Sackhead. Why not? We get a black heart out of the fire and also enough to buy a soul heart and an I'm excited pill. Let's wait till our item room to see if we need that charge going into the boss fight. Played chicken there a little bit, which is probably not a good idea with these guys. Pretty much don't want to be in front of these guys ever. So close to hitting that tinted rock. What's happening? Oh, I'm excited goes through the whole floor, huh? Did I know that? Really hate this. Absolutely hate this. Gimpy has paid out a little bit. Very much hate this. Thanks, I hate it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, we do have our... Um boss fight that's not a boss fight did not mean to pick up that key was looking at the map we got a planetarium let's go let's go very rare room the planetarium boys oh baby drink it in oh yeah mars double tap dash double tap dash I'm not sure what that means. I really don't know what that means, but I'm happy to have it. All the planetarium items are usually very good. I'm going to put this here for the soul fires. Wow. Okay. Dude, that's so exciting. That is my second planetarium ever. That shows you how rare they are considering I stream this game like seven to eight hours a day. Uh, every day except Sunday. So, um, yeah. And also, I play it here on YouTube. That shows you how rare they are. Oh, there it was. I don't know how I did it. it says... 
Okay. Okay, it's a lot easier to do with the D-pad. Unfortunately, I do not play with the D-pad. Ah, all right, all right, all right. That little dink noise is it recharging, I guess. You know what? Since uh, since I'm feeling spicy, let's check this out. And it is more money. Not great. <laughs> it's kind of sick. I'm assuming you do damage in that dash, I would guess. It's a nice way to skirt around the map, that's for sure. All right, I think it's time to get out of here. What was the item room? It was speedball, right? All right, what was it? It was like um, Caves 2, I think. It was Caves 2. The good thing is I'm pretty sure we dropped it on the boss room. If we don't see it in the boss room, we know that we uh, dropped it in the item room. The thing with the dash is definitely you're gonna get some involuntary dashes like that. Like obviously, I didn't mean to dash like uh, away from everybody, but I'm sure I'm sure it can only really help. Okay, I didn't kill him. Okay, I thought for sure it was gonna kill him, but it didn't. Ooh, it got a tinted rock. Oh my gosh, soul hearts galore, jeez. Depths two. I tried to bank on the dash there, bad idea. Tried to dash through them all. It is pretty fun when you can execute it. Oh, no. There's times where I forget that I'm, like, going reverse and I enter the item room and there's a split second where I'm like, wait, where's the item? Okay, depth's one. So I'm thinking our crack key should be on the next floor. I believe. Oh no. No, no, no. There it is. That's what we're looking for. And that is what we're looking for. It's gotta be the mitre, right? And I guess the, the purity trinket that's given us all these soul hearts. They're coming in hot. Very hard to dodge all those. That was sick. <laughs> Caves one. Didn't mean to dodge right in front of the enemies. Not the best idea. You are insane. No, 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 no. Don't get hit by green flies. Come on, man. What are we doing? Can you? I don't even know if you could bomb out of these rooms. Oh, you can. Nice. We've taken way too much damage. Someone told me to pick this up, but I think someone said to pick it up early in the run. Uh, so it's definitely not early in the run, but it's, um, we, we have picked it up. Just 
The dash got us into a bad position there. <laughs> We are definitely not that strong. Um, we are also taking too much damage here. I, 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 I'm going to be honest. This thing is just running me into enemies at this point. Explosivo also becoming very dangerous for some reason. my best not to get hit here this guy does take forever to die though okay, there we go we have gone all the wrong ways somehow somehow we did not break out of that room i put a bomb down that was close and then we also had guys that like destroy the floor and doors This is an XL, so maybe it's a little bit harder to find uh, the beginning. There it is. All right. Well, w this is what we came for. This is what we came for here. We're going to get a speed up or, you know what? Let's use it. We get damage and shot speed. That's nice. All right. We are going to, like I said, this is what we came for. We're going to use the crack key on the closet here. And then, whoa, what is that? You unlocked Apollyon. Dude, he looked crazy. Achievement unlock the empty. Bombs, pearls, range, and luck up. All right. Um, might as well give this a go, huh? Thank you, Gimpy. Very much appreciate it, Gimp. Alright, phase one of Dogma down. Phase two of Dogma is not necessarily difficult, but it's so dependent on what he does. Like, if he does the charge multiple times, very difficult, boss. If he does this a bunch of times, not so difficult. As he's doing this again, that's beautiful for us. It's not that I've never gotten hit by that attack, but it's definitely one of his easier attacks to dodge. Compared to his charge, which is... That actually was his charge, but we killed him before he could do it. That was, that was pretty good. Let's see how we do against the beast. I am skipping the cinematics. I, I give it, I gave it like almost two weeks of Isaac, uh, playing it on YouTube here and also playing a ton of it on stream. Um, I've watched the cinematics pretty much up until like late yesterday. I started skipping them. Uh, so I do apologize if you've never seen them, but we fought uh, the beast a couple of times here on YouTube. Explosivo, obviously, gigantic help during this fight. It's making us feel very powerful. Also, these little familiars that have spawned, definitely helping out as well. Trying to throw some more bombs in there just for good measure. This is going to damage us because I forgot to dodge. Usually going to get damaged when you forget the dodge. Forgot about the dash thing. It was pretty quick work there. Wow. Froze him. He came in, dropped a bunch of explosivo tears on him. Love to see it. Bad dodges. I'm in him. I'm inside of him. I dashed inside of him. Got to war's second phase pretty dang quick. We're 
Where are you going, bud? So far away. Oh, wow. War is definitely the most difficult horseman. I mean, there's probably a reason they kept him for last because of that. Because he is the most difficult horseman. But we did get him. Now it's beast time. I wonder if these familiars are going to move with me. Familiars are going to move with me. That's nice. This is like the one instance where fast bombs would actually be insanely nice. Just a lot of explosions going on right now. <laughs> The bombs when you're moving are, are nice because they kind of have some momentum to them and, and the beast runs into them. Are we going left again? I mean, bombs do speed up that fight, but... Wow, Explosivo really helped. That is going to do it. That is going to do it. That is a victory there with Apollyon, but the big victory is this right here. The Abyss. Apollyon. Tainted. Win streaks up to four. Let's go, baby. Hope you guys enjoyed that one. If you did, leave me a like. Helps me out a ton. Um, and also, shout out to all the Patreons on the right side of the screen. Top left is the next video you may have not seen. Bottom left is how you join the Patreon. And then hit the picture of me to subscribe, hit the bell, turn on notifications. Thank you guys for watching. Until next time, stay safe, stay up, and peace out.